This year, we are proud to bring you the event here at Desert Stages Theater, the place you know and love. Now, that being said, we're not the biggest facility in the world, so we're gonna have the silent auction online. But trust me, it's very easy and anybody can do it. So what we're gonna do is learn what we need to make that happen. First, a computer and or smartphone. Last but not least, the credit card. It will help if there's money on it. For those of you using a computer, you're going to want to go to biddingforgood.com slash DSTPVB. Once there, at the top left corner, you will see a place where you can register or sign in if you have already done so. Now, look to your left. You will see all of our items listed, either by category or all on one page. Take a look. Ooh, pretty good stuff, huh? Well, take a look at your favorite item and click on it. Here you will see a description of the item, the value, and most importantly, the current bid. Now, this is what you want. So you're going to bid. How many different ways can I bid? There are two types of bid. The proxy bid. Essentially, you're saying how much you would pay, and then the computer does the work for you. It will bid automatically against your competitors. It will also let you know if you've gotten outbid. You can also place a straight bid which is essentially that, a straight bid that just goes through one time. For either type of bid, you will be notified by email and or text when you are outbid. Remember, items may be purchased outright at the Buy It Now option. To check on any of your bids at any time, go to My Items, link at the top right of the page. Have fun and good luck. Oh, I get it. Monday, March 25th, we can start to bid at home. All I have to do is go to my computer, type in biddingforgood.com backslash DSTPBB and I can start bidding. You will be notified at 8 p.m. on April 6th what you have won. Remember, no fighting, no pushing, and no shoving. When using a smartphone, all the same rules I have just mentioned applied, except now you're going to go to m.bforg.com slash auctions slash 185468985. Again, have fun and good luck. And then when I'm at the theater, I take out my cell phone, I punch in those numbers. What were they again? Oh, they're right down here. Check it out. Punch them in, start bidding, and I'm off to the races. Let's go. And remember, anyone can do it. And I do mean anyone. Even me? Yes, even you, weird caveman guy. What about me? What about me? What about me, yeah? What about me? What about me? How much is that doggy in the window? Oh, oh. The one with the waggly chair. This little guy is a rescue chihuahua born December 28th, 2012. He will be available at the live auction, but you have to be there. Mom, get me the puppy! Now why do you want that puppy? Because he's so cute and he's so soft. Kevin, I have never wanted a gala puppy so much. Um, I can say he's extremely sweet and friendly. Um, he plays great with other dogs and he loves children. And he's just a super sweet. Okay. Now, what are you gonna miss most? Well, I'm gonna miss Bruiser a lot because he was sweet, friendly, he's nice to me, and I love him because he's adorable. <laughs> I want him too. I love that puppy. Uh, are you getting the puppy? I would love this puppy. How do you do? 
He did well. He lost a little focus, but other than that. <laughs> is, this, is this his first audition? This is his first audition. He has not auditioned before. Oh, yes. he is. So beautiful. Star of the Thank show. You. Right here. Uh -huh. Tucker. Tucker. He really likes me. <laughs> it's the fam. <laughs> Sense, you'll hear a snap. Wait a sec. This is the kind of girl Warner wants. Someone serious. Oh my god, oh my god, you guys. Looks like Elle's gonna win the prize. If there ever was a perfect couple, this one qualifies. Oh my god, you guys. Oh my god, this is happening. Our own home, coming queen and king. Finally, she'll be trying on a huge. is about an Englishman who comes over with his uh, British Army friend and he's having some issues with his wife and he doesn't want to have to talk to anyone. He's just gotten this terribly painful shyness he's developed and his friend figures out he can make up a story to get him out of having to talk to anyone. Um, I play the Reverend David Marshall Lee and he is staying at the Meeks Lodge which is where um, Foreigner takes place. Are you trying to, you know, Win people over? Uh, I'm trying to win people over. He's a good guy. Um, there may be more than meets the eye. Oh, with him, you have so, to come uh, see it, right? You'll have to tune in to find out. Now, now, what was the hardest prop to find? I guess the uh, the antelope head. It's, oh, where's the antelope head? It's, on, it's on, it? on its way. Oh, <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> 